All right, let's agonizing remorse. We're not going to explore because we don't have a land that we are able to play as far as we, as far as we know. Okay, swords to plowshares, but it has Yargle on it, so they can't legally target our Yargle. Oh well, well, what do we have here? We have an exiled Euro, Titan of Nature's Wrath. That's gone forever. Even though we could get it with Cling to Dust, not the point. Not at all the point. Maybe figure out other... Oh, Brainstorm during the main phase. That's not good. That's bad for you. <laughs> yes. Uh, what is up, everyone? It's the time you've been waiting for. Historic Brawl. March of the Machine. It's Yargle time and Multani. But mainly Yargle time because we are playing Yargle and his friend that loves him very much, as you could tell by the art, Multani. So... This deck is quite straightforward. We can only kill people with Yargle and or Multani. And I say and or because obviously we can kill people with Yargle and Multani, which is just an 18-6. No other abilities, just a bunch of flavor text. Or we can kill people with Yargle or we can kill people with Multani. That's it. Those are the only ways. So we've packed our deck with a bunch of discard, a bunch of kill spells, a bunch of ramp to try to make sure we can kill people with Yargle and Multani, Yargle and or Yargle and Multano and or Multani. Okay? You got it? That's the only thing that we're doing. Maybe we could accidentally mill someone out with Altar of Dimension because we can sacrifice our Yargle and or Mortani and Mortani or Yargle multiple times. And uh, maybe we'll win like that. Who knows? Who knows? It's going to be crazy. It's Yargle time. But before we get into the games... Please be sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel to keep seeing this sweet, sweet content every week. Yargle time number one. Jadar, Ghoul Caller of Nefalia. We're on the draw. This is not a very good hand. Mulligan. Okay, this is much better. Black Mark Connections, Grow from the Ashes, Maze Mind Tomb, and other other cards. Doom Blade. Not very good here. Maybe they have an artifact creature we could kill, but we definitely can't kill Jadar. I have a lot of removal spells in my deck. I'm going to draw Doom Blade for real. Get me to take that out. All right. Forest. Hello. Mm, they must know we have a Doom Blade. They're being awfully kind. Ooh, no turn two Jadar. I like that. I like that a lot. All right. Let's just play this Maze, Maze Mind Tome. Probably going to draw cards with Maze Mind Tome. Probably. We're going to have a lot of mana. All right. There's Jadar. There he is. Okay. Let's play Black Market Connections and then pass the turn. And we're going to potentially do the full-on six. Okay, that's that's fine. Maybe they'll take Doomblade. I'd hate for you to... Uh, hate for you to take our only creature removal spell. Grow from the ashes? Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Would have rather grow from the ashes than our promise, but, you know. Beggars, choosers, etc., etc. Maybe they don't have a land. Drill bit. Okay. Okay, they're taking both of our ramp. All right. Okay, I mean, look. It's not the greatest. Okay, we have two... Uh, yeah, we're going full, full six... Assassin's Trophy. Okay. We cannot play... We cannot Yargle yet. Not yet. Um, well, let's just pass... Let's just pass the turn. They didn't have a land. They just have a bunch of discard spells. Yeah, we'll take two. We'll take two. That's fine. Uh, no blocks. What are, what are they going to do if we get Yargle out? Because Yargle is... Yargle be coming. Okay? Yargle is on his way. Hey, that's a way to kill Jadar. Uh, let's make a treasure and draw a card. Okay, we have found... We have found our way to kill Jadar. But right now, we gonna be Yargling. It's Yargle time. It's always Yargle time. That's the secret. That's the secret about Yargle. It's always Yargle time. I guess Multani's here too. Sacrifice the highest? Okay, that's fine. 
Okay, we'll sacrifice the highest. No, we're not gonna move it to the command zone. It's gonna come back. Uh, we're gonna kill Jadar, so let's go ahead and like block this. Actually, let's just take, let's just take, let's just take two, that's fine. Okay, sacrifice into combat. Okay, we're getting pretty low. We're getting pretty low. I think we need to scry, mainly because we need to gain life. Key to the city? That makes Yargle unblockable. Uh, no, let's, let's put it on the bottom. Okay. We're just gonna make a treasure token. Okay, uh, well, we're gonna cut down Jadar, that's for sure. We're going to explore Swiftfoot Boots. Oh, Swiftfoot Boots, that's good. Yeah, give it on, give us some hex proof now. Uh, here we come. We're attacking for 21. <laughs> oh, they're getting, they're getting Yargled good. Uh, yes. The Yargling. Okay, what do you have now? Another sacrifice thing will do it. Uh, we'll get Yargle. But Yargle will be back very soon. Like, next, the next turn. Yeah, yeah. We'll take it. We'll take two. They have a regular sacrifice thing. That won't work. We have our uh, shapeshifter to protect Yargle from sacrifice chain again. Jadar! Uh, yeah, let's just scry. Mirror shield. That doesn't matter. Okay. Okay, I put a, I put a stop on, but, you know... What do I know? We're at six? Let's draw a card and lose a life. Death Sprout. Let's do it! Kill Jadar! Get a, get a, get a land? Yes! They have been Yarkled! <laughs> that doesn't take much. It doesn't take much. Alright, on the play against Atraxa Praetor's Voice. We do have a discard spell and a kill a couple of kill spells. This is this is fine. This is fine. Yargling takes time. Okay, you can't just come out here and just like and just yargle. We're gonna we're gonna pass the turn though. We're gonna we're gonna wait until we can maybe hit something a little juicier. So they'll be playing one of them planeswalker cards. One of those new fangled planeswalker cards I keep hearing about. So uh, status and statue is a sweet one because we can give it death touch and if Yargle has trample that that means we can get the we can maximum Yargling and now we can kill this on our turn which this is a sorcery so we're gonna go ahead and do that okay Yargling is slow you gotta be really you gotta be really committed to doing the full Yargle. All right, it's time for a duress. Time for a duress. River's Rebuke. God, they got a lot of cards I don't like. Jeez Louise. Uh, Tamio, Tamio could be pretty bad. Tamio could be bad for us. I think Tefri's the worst for us. Tamio coming down next turn. Oh yeah. Whoever we let them have is coming out next turn. We basically get to pick their play. Um, I, I think we're going to have worse time getting rid of Tamio, So let's just go ahead and get rid of Tamio. It's not, not ideal. They got a lot of Planeswalkers. They do be a Traxxan. They do be like that sometimes. Inquisition, swing and a miss. Can't get nothing. Now you can play Rim and Rim, Rin, 
and Realm Breaker. Okay. We'll play this swamp that you know about. Um, wish this could kill Planeswalkers. Alright, let's go ahead and exile Tamyo. Make a 2-2. And then we'll just pass the turn. I might I might mess around and block a land. Alright, they're gonna they're gonna attack. Or they're gonna they're gonna bounce this. That's fine. I mean, it's not great, but you know, it's fine. They're milling three, get back a permanent. Oh, probably gonna get back oh, they got back a land. Oh, they're looking for a land. Okay, because they didn't hit one. Feign death. Okay. Okay. Not gonna be good against River's Rebuke. Like, not at all. Okay. Well, we don't want a Yargle. Because we don't want them... We want to be able to feign death and... You know, like, do something. Protect it, perhaps. Okay. So we can't cast spells... And they can cast spells. They're going to mill three, pick up another land, almost assuredly. Oh, no, they got Ashiok? That's much worse. I'm seeing that this is a bad, bad, bad matchup for us. We do have a backup Yargle. Backup Yargle, okay? So, perhaps we play the backup Yargle. We'll hold that in our hand in case we need to, like, exile something. Nah, we'll play it. Whatever. Okay. Got a backup Yargle. This Yargle can hit. At this price point, he can hit. Okay. Alright, should we... get rid of... I don't know about Feign Death. Alright, let's get rid of this, uh... this instant speed kill spell. You're here. Okay. Don't worry. So they can Rivers Rebuke at instant speed. Very cool. Very cool. I don't think we're going to be able to win this game. We need to draw Blood on the Snow. If we draw Blood on the Snow, we have a shot. That's not a, not a good shot, but it is, it is a shot. All right, Yargle. He's back. He's Yargling. It's what he does best. You know who doesn't care about Tasha? Yargle. Minus one, minus one counter? Oh no, it's only going to be 17 power. So, let's, let's see. What can we possibly do? Blood on the snow? That's what we really need. Up to one land. Okay, bounce that. Yargle's back in the hand. We're making their River's Rebuke really bad. Huh? Cling to dust? Okay. That's not blood on the snow. God, they could mill us in... Oh god, if they minus six, we're, we're like super dead. I mean, they don't know that, but it's the truth. Okay, let's play Black Market Connections and then Helm of the Host. Enough with this Yargling. That is, that's not working. Yeah, we, we literally just, like, lose the game till they reveal three, put the rest into the graveyard. And they don't know that. But they might figure it out here in a second. <laughs> they might just figure it out. Yeah, we only have Multani. All we have is Multani. Okay, Elspeth conquers death. Right on. Getting rid of what? Helm of the Host? Black and Market Connections? Which one? Probably Black Market Connections. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. God, don't minus six. Just keep going upstairs. Okay? Just keep going upstairs with Tasha. Okay, okay. Good, 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 good. 
All right. I've never seen someone be able to do less getting a uh, Vraska Betrayal Sting. Okay. Exile 1, 2. Exile 1, 2. Okay. Just getting us closer to Blood on the Snow. That's all you're doing. Just getting us closer. Black Blade Reforged. Okay. Let's play Yargle. Let's play a Black Blade Reforged. Okay. What if... What if... We just popped him one good time. Okay. I can cast stuff at instant speed. Ren, going back up. My voice beckons to all worlds. Ashok, what you doing? Tasha, what are you doing? Okay. Alright, we're gonna get rid of this feign death that we can't cast, because we can't cast any instance. Tasha? Don't minus six. Oh, no! <laughs> no! No! They figured it out. They figured it out. We didn't have a murderous rider. I guess we had three creatures total. <laughs> no! No, not like this. Tasha, <laughs> I talked, talked bad about you too much. On the play against Atali Primal Conqueror. Atali, obviously, no match for Yargle. We will keep. We got a Death Sprout, do a little ramp action. Know what I mean? We got an Assassin's Trophy to kill their commander, which may or may not be a good idea. Oh, we have our we have Yargle and Multani and Yargle and Multani. Um, amazing. Everything's working out exactly as planned. Naga Vitalist. Ooh, that was a really good draw. Black Market Connections. Okay. Circuitous Route. So they're going, getting two lands. So potentially... Oh, there's blood on the snow. All right, uh, let's make a treasure and draw a card. All right, land. Excellent. That's just what we want. All right, we're going to kill the, kill you. Kill this Naga Vitalist. We're going to get a forest. Casualties of War, that's coming next. I'll take a two for one. Don't think I won't do it. Invasion of Zendikar. But, well, that's difficult. I can't kill that. Okay, Feign Death. Let's get a treasure and draw a card again. Into the North, huh? Okay, let's just play Yargle and Multani. And we'll pay, pay this mana. Okay, we have a feign death in case something goes wrong. Although, how could it? What could possibly go wrong? Itali, alright. Okay, make it happen. What do we have? I don't want to look, I like to be surprised. Goose? Okay. You have a goose. What do you have from us? Nothing? Supernatural stamina? Nice. Nice. Okay. Oh, status and stature. All right, same thing. Treasure, draw a card. Uh, Takanuma, you're going to be a land. Okay, let's get... Let's casualties of war... And we're going to kill an artifact, a creature, and a land. Okay, artifact, creature. Yes! Yes! They have been yargled. They can't can't overcome the yargling. Uh, on the draw against Joda, Archimage Eternal, the fun Joda. This is a mulligan, though. We need more lands and stuff. Okay, assemble the team. That can find us a land. So, this is pretty mediocre, but I'd rather keep this than a six. And we do have ways to kill Joda. Land more elves? Okay. Alright. 
Well, let's play a snow covered swamp and pass the turn. Languish on Jota will be nice. Uh, they're not close to Jota. Okay. Alright, here's an end to the north. Smart. They don't want to get down. You don't want to get down to Yargle range. They're already at 24. You're, you're practically in Yargle range. You're practically in Yargle range. Okay. Um, let's just let's go ahead and assemble the team, just and find and just get a land. Unless there's not one in the top third of our deck, that would be kind of crazy. Okay, there there is. Against against all odds. Uh, let's just get this castle locked, Wayne. That'll leave us with one green. We don't even have any green. Okay, castle locked, Wayne. Okay, not a problem. Bingo, bango. If they play Jota now, they gotta take two damage. Gotta take two damage to play Jota now. Which I like. That gets... Okay, they're not playing Jota now. That's just gonna be more Yargling later. 23. If they get to that 18 range, that's a one hit. That's a one Yargle hit. Oh, no. Overwhelming Splendor? That's no good. Oh, Black Market Connections. Really good at drawing this on turn three. Let's play it. Play the Connections. Okay, we want this gone. Overwhelming Splendor? No, that's a no. That's a negative. Celestus. Okay. Are they trying to play this and play a spell at the same time? Okay, let's make a treasure and draw a card. Okay, we've drawn. Fine. I mean, I guess I guess we're gonna let's just be, let's beat up their mana if this is what they if they if they if they want to try to fight on this axis. Fine. I'm giving you the opportunity to play your commander, and you have not taken it. You have not taken it, so you're gonna get punished. Now, if you play your commander, I can just eat it with a single removal spell, dark ritual. Okay. We can play him now. Temporary? Oh, I don't care for that. I can't kill it, but I still don't like it. Okay. That means we're not Yargling quite yet. They did not draw a land. Which means our decision was a good one. Uh, treasure draw. I'll take three. Okay, uh, this is going to be green. Uh, first thing we're going to do is never to return. You're dead. And then we're going to go get two more lands. Or gates. We don't have any gates, though. Let's just get two forests. Okay. Arcane Signet. All right. That can cast your commander. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Same thing. Going to keep it going. Blooming Marsh. Let's cast... Lang... Actually... Yeah, let's cast Languish. Kill your commander. Then we're going to collect a Brutality you. We're going to have you reveal your hand. We're going to take a big nasty thing, hopefully. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Genesis Ultimatum. Why don't you get on out of here, Genesis Ultimatum? Okay. Uh, Yargle is coming to town next turn. Faithless looting. Are you going to keep this ruinous ultimatum or an another card? They are going to keep the ruinous ultimatum. Okay. Um, we're just going to lose a. L uh. Yeah, let's just draw a card. Because I think we're going to get a ruinous ultimatum. Oh baby. Oh my. Okay. Yargle. High as ghost form. Okay. So, 
If Yargle dies or is exiled, Yargle comes back. Okay. There's Joda. Joda doesn't Joda doesn't know that we are All right, so I get treasure. That we're Helm of the Hosting, but we're about to do it right now. Helm of the Host, Yargle it up. Let's go ahead and get something out of your hand. I don't know what you got. Mizix Mastery, that's gone. All right, and here we come. And you must block with Joda, lest you be Yargled. Lest you get the full Yargling. They're at four. I don't think they can cast this. This this little Yavimaya Coast is really cramping their style. They have red here, they have red here, white here, white here, black here, black here. Uh, Yavimaya Coast is going to kill them. White. Oh, can they untap it? Can they untap? Oh, they can't untap? So they're going to get the full Yargling? Yes! Yes! Yes. Oh, baby. On the draw against Slimefoot and Squee. Slimefoot and Squee's pretty good. We'll, we'll keep this hand, though. We have an Inquisition. Removal spell, but it can't kill Slimefoot and Squee. I believe. I believe in this. I believe in a thing called Yargle. And truly, what is there more to believe in than Yargle? Oh, man. We could take a land? I, how could I resist? The answer is I can't. I can't resist. Undead butler. Right on. Okay. Do they have another land? They might not. Let's play Swiftfoot Boots. When we get when we're gonna Yargle, it's gonna be a fast Yargle. Don't play a land. Rats. Alright, they now they can solemn and all this other nonsense. Oh. We have we have multi multi Yargle. Multi Yargle action. Okay, Death Cap Glade. Shadow Spear. We can get back. Uh, we can get rid of Fungal, Rebirth, Sacrifice, Return this, and other one target creature from your graveyard. Okay, so if this is dead, so this has to be dead, and then they can, uh, reanimate this and something else. Okay, so... Let's... Give something minus two, minus two. What would they be able to get back? Oh, they get back this. I don't, we don't want them to do that. Okay. All right. We're just going to get this fungal rebirth then. Yeah. Let's get rid of this fungal rebirth. We're not, we're not down with that. But what we are down with is getting our Yargle on. We, you know what would be the best draw? is something that got us two lands. So I got us two lands would be really, really good. Maybe we should play Solemn as a as Well, no, I, I wanna keep it to the okay, Assassin's Trophy. Alright. Home of the host. And once we once we Yargle, there'll be no coming back. But we have to get the Yargle. Oh no, that's bad news. Oh my gosh. If they make a thing, a big uh, tree folk, we could be dead. Okay, they didn't make a tree folk. Okay. That's good. Tear asunder, that's even better. Means we can exile this? We have to exile this. Alright, let's go ahead and do that. Exile Ren and Seven. You're gone. Okay, we're getting attacked... For nine, we're going to go to two. Two is not very good. We need to get... We need to get some sort of sweeper. We are dead. We have not... We did not get to Yargle. They they survived the Yargling this game. They survived. We never want people to survive the Yargling. Not even playing around Settle the Wreckage. Unbelievable. The disrespect of our opponent, but... 
They're correct not to, because uh, it's not in our deck, or nor can it be. On the play against Yarok, we have a removal spell for Yarok. We have uh, Rim, Realm Breaker, the Invasion Shred. I kind of want to try that one. So we'll keep we'll keep this hand. Little Swift Foot Boosties. Little Bootsies right here for our, you know, I don't know how many feet we have here, but, um, you know, they got the feet. They got the feet. There's boots, boots for however many feet Yargle has. And for that, I can appreciate. Okay, uh, let's play Realm Breaker, the Invasion Tree. Just wanted to, you know, wanted to get this card out for the first time. Give a little college try here. Euro Titan of Nature's Wrath, huh? Really unfortunate with Realm Breaker. And we're going to give them cards into their deck. Maybe I don't want to do that. Maybe I don't want to do that now. All right, Maze Mind Tome. Plan B. Not not a good not a great plan. Not a great plan. But it is it is our it is our new plan. Okay. Do we have a Yarok? We have an Aether Channeler. They can bounce something. Do they bounce Maze Mind Tome? Or do they just draw a card? They're going to draw a card. I don't blame them. Pass. All right. Let's. Oh, they're in their combat. Whatever. Scry. All right. Land. We'll keep that on top. We'll, we're going to go ahead and kill this Aether Channeler. Cut down. Not able to get their commander, so... Alright. And we will... Pass. Man, wish I had this Realm Breaker in my hand. Really wish I had it in my hand. Tireless Provisioner. Okay. Collector Brutality is probably going to get that one. Okay. They have one, two, three, four mana. And we'll go to our turn. We'll draw a card. End it there in a turn. Blackblade Reforged. Okay. Well, let's Collective Brutality. Uh, we're going to kill this and get something out of their hand. We're going to get rid of Blackblade Reforged. Unfortunately, but I think it's what we got to do. Okay. Do they have a something that stops this? Pack negation. Wow. That's a that's an important tireless provisioner there. Okay. So be it. So be it. Growth spiral. Okay. All right, I gotta pay five. I can get another thing. I mean, I did want to kill that. We even escalated. Got rid of our black blade. That's not fun. It's no fun at all. Okay, they can still play Yarok, which is pretty crazy. Pretty crazy. But they can do it. So, they have to play a land. And they still get to end up with another treasure. Alright. Playing a land untapped. Will they play Yarok? Is it time? Is it Yarok time? It is. It is Yarok time. That will resolve. When we get priority, we're going to nab its throat. Right now-ish. Feel of summer? Barf. Big barf. Big, big, big barf on that. Alright, let's let's just scry one. Forest, we'll take that. Alright. We can't protect our Yargle yet. So, we'll just pass the turn. They only need one more for Euro. 
It seems like our opponent's cards are really, really good. They might be a little better than ours, but that's a decision that we've made. They get two triggers here, huh? That's bad news for us. Probably should have just drawn a card to see if we can stop this. All right. Uh, we'll take the opportunity now. All right. Draw a card. Gain four life. Four life points. Duress. Okay. No such thing. Okay. Taking six. I think we're probably going to do this. Give him a little bit of juice. Hopefully we hit a land. Turn Timber Symbiosis, huh? Okay. All right, what could they they get? It's the top seven. It's the worst thing. They get any creature. Tireless Tracker? That's not, not that bad, actually. Okay. All right, let's mill them. Hopefully we hit a land. We can get a land back. Nice. Yes. Here's tapped. Okay. All right. It's time to boogie. Don't have something. Don't have something. Don't have something. I've earned this. I think we. I believe we have lost the game now. Because we have Euro coming back. God, really? Really? Really had to have a removal spell? I couldn't have drawn a land? I mean, I guess I could have played this other Yargle. Could have played Yargle number one. <laughs> uh, yeah, yep. Yeah. You can play two more lands. Oh, they don't have them? You just drew gas? I mean, sure. Huh, there's a, there's a, a, not even a land. Glass pool shore. Man, Yarok. What a Magic the Gathering card this is. It's a pretty good one. It's a pretty good one. I'm not mad about it. I really like this commander, but uh, really needed them just not have one kill spell. Just one. Just one. Didn't feel like I was asking for a lot. You know what? We could have... This is this is the play we could have had last turn. Swan Song. <laughs> Good lord. Okay. We're still going to hit him with a Yargle. You're not gonna block. We should get it. We should get it connect with the Yargo, and I'll feel good. I'll feel good about every decision I've made this game. Yes, take the nine. Take the nine. That's right. Now we can see. Great. We've been Yargled. On the draw against Atali Primal Conqueror. Okay. Sure. You know what? Assemble the team. Probably gonna land with this. Abundant Harvest, non-land. Okay. Well, let's play this Blooming Marsh. And we're going to assemble the team next turn, so let's go ahead and duress. What do you got? Shatter Skull Smashing? Uh, let's take Mind Stone. We got something for this Gwenna. Reckless Barbarian, huh? Snarl. Forest. Yeah, what of it? Yeah, we get uh, we we have lands to show, first time ever. Oh, can we re can we resist taking Davriel? Is the question. I don't know if we can. Maybe we want to just take Cultivate. Maybe we just take Cultivate for something to get next to play next turn. Let's just take Cultivate. Not too proud. Sometimes you gotta just be curving out, you know? Oh, they're gonna play Gwenna, actually. So, we probably should've just taken Davriel, as was original plan. Oh, they did not. They did not play Gwenna. Okay, well, look. We got rewarded. Roiling regrowth. Okay, sure. Are they just gonna play... Are they just gonna play, like, a Tali, like, straight up?
They can play Tali straight up, but we got a lot of lands now. Got a lot of lands. Maybe, uh, maybe we shouldn't have... Uh... Yeah. Yeah, right on. All right. Lightning Bolt for us and Tyvar's stand. Okay. You know what? That's not... That's not the worst. That's not the worst. All right. Uh, let's get Infernal Grasp this. Well, now you have... Now you have, like, three la three lands. Uh, let's go ahead and get this Abundant Harvest. Draw a card. Languish. Okay. I like Languish. We're going to Languish when they play this Gwenna next turn. Oh, yeah. Domri? Okay. All right. Oh, we can languish and into the north. Into the north. We will get our dual land. Here it is. And then languish. And then we're going to yargle them. We're, we're going to be yargling and bargling. Okay. They have seven mana. Eight mana. Wait. One, two. Oh, they have Castle Garenbrig. Okay. Okay. Mask of Grizzlebrand? Ooh. Uh, I want to have a Mask of Grizzlebrand. Not you. Okay, they can't equip it this turn. I guess that's good. All right. Uh, time to Yargle. Yargle with Mask of Grizzlebrand, not, not great. Not ideal. I would like to have this Mask of Grizzlebrand, actually. Flying a lifelink. Okay, we can cling to dust next turn. Man, really would like to have this. Can't tell you how much I'd like to have this. It's a lot, though. It's a heck of a lot. Oh, they're gonna they're gonna transform it. That's well, indestructible now. Okay. But well, they're not attacking. Okay. That makes things a little more interesting. Uh, cling to dust. Let's get rid of uh, lightning bolt. Sure. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of all of these. Whatever. One, two, three, four, five. Four, five. Okay. They're going to try to poison us. Circuitous Route. Well, that's interesting. This is indestructible. Indestructible. Cannot be destructed. Is what that means. And they're going to give it flying. God. This stupid Mask of Gristlebrand... Can't believe they hit that. That was a really, really good hit. Why didn't they just attack last turn? I mean, we can't attack. It's indestructible. All right. I think we're going to die to a gristle-branded, completed Itali. All right. Well, we'll give this hexproof. Yeah, they know now that uh, the skies are clear. We have gotten 11 poison counters, 12 poison counters, and uh, that's that's the game. That's the game. Yeah, yeah. No, I didn't like that one. All right, on, on the draw against Elishnorn Grand Cenobite. Gives our creature minus two, minus two. Whatever. Whatever. Yargle don't care about that. Minus two, minus two. That's still two hits. You're gonna need like you're gonna need three Elish Norns stacked up on each other. Elish, 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 Norn, Norn, Norn. That's the only thing that will kill Yargle, Yargle, Yargle. Okay, we can check for traps. Hopefully, we draw a land so we can grow from the ashes. We really want to be able to grow from the ashes on turn three. If they play a creature, I'm gonna. Giant killer? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we actually have to kill that. That's bad news for Yargle. Bad news for Yargle. Okay. Let's... Let's check for traps. 
You got any traps in there? Galma. That's kind of a trap. Adeline. That's kind of a trap, too. Which of these kills us quicker? Probably Adeline. Adeline kills us mighty quick. Alright, we'll get that. Okay, we'll play the boots first. Alright, here comes the blade. Ancestral blade. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, we did not draw a land. Swift foot boots. Just need one land. I'm not asking for much. Might be might be blood on the snowing before we yargle. <laughs> I say that as a, as a person with two lands out. Alright, Thalma. This at least has to attack first. Oh lord, okay. Alright, this is not going well. This is not going well. We thought we were going to draw a land. We have been sorely mistaken. We might just lose to Galma. An attack for five. Okay, Castle Garenbrig, thank goodness. Alright, let's... Let's black market connections, actually. Maybe, just maybe, we can draw a land and then get a treasure and then grow from the ashes. It's not ideal, I'll tell you that. But it's what we got. Okay, uh, they're taking for six. For 11. All right, there's a land. Okay, let's just make a treasure. Okay, uh, grow from the ashes. Here's the problem. They can just play this tempered steel. And then kill us. Maybe they think that we have a kill spell. Could be. Could be. We've got two lands untapped. Got two lands untapped. Could have anything. Could have anything. Definitely don't play a Tempered Steel. Definitely don't play a Tempered Steel. Oh, they didn't play a Tempered Steel. Okay. Uh, yeah. We are going to go to two. Oh, what are we going to do about this? Go to three, and then we'll go to two. What are we going to do? I really don't know what are we going to do about... Our, our black market connections. It can't. It help us cast a thing. Okay, uh, let's make a treasure. Okay, uh, let's kill all the destroy all creatures. Sure, we'll pay with snow. Why not? They probably just have a, a don't kill my creatures card, which is which is why we're in the situation we're in. Blessed Defiance, is, it, is this indestructible now? Oh, they get it. Oh no! They're gonna get us with the spirit? They're gonna get us with the spirit? That is, that is crazy. Oh, bloodline calling, that would've been good. Oh my god, are they really gonna get us with the spirit? They're gonna get us with the spirit. Ancestral Blade can go on it, and uh, that's two, it's two damage. Wow. Wow! They're gonna make us die to our own black market connections. Fine. We'll go out in style. Oh, we don't even get all the triggers? <laughs> we don't even get all the triggers. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Good game. Okay. On the draw against uh, Dorothea Vengeful Victim. This is a little bit of a slow hand, but we have some ramp. We have a little bit of draw. I think we could think think it can happen. I think it can happen. All right. Castle. Garon Brig. Untap land on turn two would go a long way. I think it's a four four for two. Remember, tax or block, sacrifice it. Still, still nuts. Okay. And then, whenever it attacks, so you basically get to uh, Geist of Saint Dorethra it. 
Okay, I'm picking up what you're putting down. We're, we might be clinging to dust. I could do the old cling to dust. So we're going to play a creature. Selfless spirit. And then they are going to try to disturb it. So when they cast it, uh, we put it in a graveyard from anywhere, exile it. Okay. Alright, we'll pass the turn. Actually, we gotta do it now, don't we? Okay. Well, let's just do it now. Let's get this going. I don't even, I don't even want that happening, even for a little bit of time. Opt, okay. Well, we're just going to tap this. We ain't got time for all this. Okay. So, whenever this creature attacks, make a spirit that's tapped and attacking, sacrifice... Yeah, so it's Geist of St. Dorithra. Dorothea. Dorothea. Okay, we want to land. See if we can find a land. We did find a land. Okay, could have just done nothing, but that's okay. Worth it. And Circus Route. And let's get a little 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 one of each. We'll call them A, we'll call them B here. We got another ramp here. Rattle Chains. And an Into the North. Topple Geist. Okay. They're going pretty hard with the spirits. Esper Sentinel. Okay. Alright. Let's play. Let's try to Death Sprout this. We will pay. We'll pay one. Shore up. Give it hexproof. Okay. It's not, not the worst. Not great, but not terrible. Okay, into the north. The north. Woodland Chasm. Uh, I think we're going to... We're probably going to play Multani. It's got Reach next turn. So Multani, and then we can we can also play Swiftfoot Boots and suit it up. Alright, we're going to take six here. Which is... You know... Let's put a little put a little fear in us. I don't think we need Yargle. We have Multani. We have two Multanis, one Yargle. It's really all you need. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. God, do we have do we give them a land? Or do we give them a card? I think we do. I think it's I think it's probably worth it. No. In in the assumption that uh, Multani can provide some defense, and if Multani can't provide defense because it gets removed, oh, lose all its abilities. Oh, wow, it's a zero, 0 Nice. Wow, that was actually... That was brutal. That was brutal for us. Yargle... That would have done nothing to Yargle. This is a spirit. So they... It's got flash. We're gonna definitely gonna need to gain some life here. Sacrifice it into combat. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. All right, uh, just checking. This is 10, okay. All right, we're at one. One life to live. Uh, we might be casualties of warring. I think we might draw a card and then actually, no, let's just scry. Let's just scry. Let's not get crazy. Let's not get crazy. Snow-covered forest, that's on the bottom. Okay. Malkir Rebirth. Oh, 
this is bad news. I think we're dead. I think we're dead to spirits. Creature, artifact, and land. Target an artifact. Target a creature. Target a land. We'll pay one. Okay, Selfless Spirit. Okay, those get Hexproof. Tap for a blue. We'll go to combat. Get this blue gone. Oh no, a Bird Spirit? No, we're not even going to lose to this. Wow. Good, there, they got us. Mausoleum Wanderer gonna do a little bit of protection. Good game. Good game. They out yargled the Yargle. Can't believe it. Well, that was Yargle Multani, and I just want to say I appreciate Wizards making this card. Um, you know, it says Yargle and Multani. It's really just two Yargle stapled together. And that's really all that we need is two Yargle stapled together. Sometimes Yargle worked out, sometimes Yargle didn't work out. And that is the beauty of Yargle. I will say, adding green to Yargle to give it an extra little color identity is excellent because black on its own, really tough to make Yargle work. And green helped a lot. We didn't get to do all of the Yargle plays that I wanted to, but we got to do some of it. And uh, when you're Yargling, that's really all that you can hope for. Thank you all so much for making it to the end of the video. Please throw a like on here if you enjoyed the Yargling. And of course, subscribe to this channel so you can see some Yargling in the future. And maybe some more March of the Machine legends as we go through every single one. If you want to follow me on social media, find out what I'm doing I'm not on YouTube, you can do so right down here, including on Twitch where I stream Gladiator every Wednesday at 8 p.m. And maybe you can play Gladiator with me and show up on the channel later. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm Justin Parnell. We'll see you next time.